In this video, we are going to see the installation of Solus 4.0 operating system with budget desktop environment in VMware Workstation. Already I have created virtual machine for this installation. Let's edit the settings. As you can see, I have assigned 2 GB of memory to this VM with 50 GB of hard disk space. Already I have attached the ISO image of this Solus 4.0 operating system. You can download this ISO image from their official website. Link to download this ISO image is also given in the description area. Now let's click on OK button and let's start this virtual machine. Here we have a total two options. The first one is to start Solus 4.0 operating system and the second option is to reboot your VM into firmware interface. We are going to select the first one and then here I am going to press enter key. This will be the first console after booting up a Solus operating system. Unlike the other operating system, installer will not start automatically. So you need to launch the installer. For that, we need to click here on launch install operating system. That will start a wizard. Here it is asking us to select the language which you are going to use during the installation process. I am going to select English United States. Let's click on next. Next again, I am not going to specify my location. Here it is asking us to choose keyboard layout. In our case, it will be English US. Let's click on next. It is asking us to choose your time zone. I am going to specify India as right now I am in India. Let's click on next. Here it is asking us that where you want to install this Solus operating system. Already as you can see our VMware virtual hard disk is selected and for this demonstration we are going to select the first option which is automatically partition this empty disk and install a fresh copy of Solus operating system. Let's click on next. If you want to use LVM for this new installation you can select this checkbox. But as of now we are just going for the testing purpose that's why I'm not going to select this one. Let's click on next. It is asking us to specify host name for this operating system. Here I am specifying the host name mbn-vm and then it is also asking us to specify the location where you want to install bootloader. It will be on slash dev slash sda. Let's click on next. Here we need to specify a username. Once you specify all the details about username, real name, password and then after you need to click on this add now button. If you want to add other users as well that time you can click on this plus sign that will gives you one more console to add user. We are going to use only one user. Let's click on next. So on this console you can review your selection if you want to change anything that time you can change it from here. If you are happy with the selection you can click on this install button to start the installation. So let's click on install button to start the installation process. Click on OK. Installation process will take some time to complete and once the installation complete it will ask you to restart this virtual machine. As you can see installation has been completed successfully. We need to restart this computer once. So let's click on restart now to restart it. Let's specify the password and hit enter. This is the desktop of Solus operating system. You can open the application menu from here. Here we have accessories, graphics, internet. You can see Firefox is there. This is the by default web browser available in Solus operating system. Uh, here we have a Mozilla Thunderbird mail client, transmission BitTorrent client as well. As an office tool, we have a LibreOffice. For sound and video, here you can see rhythm boxes here as well as genome MPV. Let's click on system settings and here we have about, let's click on about. As you can see, Solus 4.0 operating system is installed on a computer. Let's close this. So in this video, we have seen that how we can install Solus 4.0 operating system with budget desktop environment in a VMware workstation. Thank you all for watching this video.